stupid government cans. Welcome to the Whistle and Diesel YouTube channel. As you can see, we're on the good old Kawasaki 3 Tracks 850 here. One thing that I noticed, you know, I was just sitting in my yard the other day and I started looking at it and I noticed it looks like a freaking nine year old made this thing. What the heck is this supposed to be? Like they put mud flaps on here to like block the, the mud from coming up or something. Like this thing doesn't even have nine foot long razor blade spikes on it. So uh, there's obviously some major problems going on at the Honda Design Factory. So in the next eight hours, we're gonna transform this four-wheeler into a completely capable, bone-crushing, skin-ripping, muscle-tearing, meat-eating, zombie-apocalyptic Area 51 rating machine. So here we have four uh, perfectly good wheels with not so good tires on them. These are super swampers off of the other Honda 4Trax. They have like 37 tire plugs in them, just absolutely everywhere. When I was a kid, I actually got caught in 17 acres of barbed wire fence once. <laughs> Anyways. pulling off these tires and uh hey Maisie what's up we're pulling off these tires and we're putting the rims on funny because I was actually telling Nick the other day when we let we were letting stuff down hard on the jack and the front end of everything was like so out of line so I was telling him be a little easy when you what are you doing get to work completely chopping these skis up there might be nothing left by the time we're done and uh, we're gonna have an entire bucket of spikes we're gonna have to weld on this plug here was left out all night and it rained just a little bit ago and it's metal there and I just picked that thing right up it's 220 and it just shocked me I was having these nice beads and he goes over and he's like come here and look at this so uh, this looks like a freaking angel spit on it all right Nick so what did the um, dad welder say to the son welder when he was doing a bad job what you're not grounded <laughs> that's a knee slapper right there So Nick and I have spent the last 12 to 14 hours 
cutting up metal, welding it onto these rims, and uh, the end result here is amazing. Honestly, it's, it's so cool. These things are ridiculous. Like they look like tillers, like the most aggressive, the most aggressive things you ever see. There is seriously a lot of danger involved putting these on. There's a really high chance that if you slip off of those, your leg is gonna get sucked under one of these and it's gonna rip your whole freaking shin off. This is, this is quite insane. Uh, this four wheeler is gonna look absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> oh, she is a mean machine. Oh my god. The coolest thing that we've ever freaking built. We are really worried about, since there's no fender guards, um, obviously, you slip once, you're dead. Riding up hills and stuff, our leg slips off. Oh, whoops. Just the edge of one spike caught it. Sucks your whole leg under there. And then, uh, well, the rest of you is going to go with it. So uh, you can see about how dangerous that might be going 60, which we are going to do. You may be wondering, with wheels like this, how are we going to have traction? Here we go, boys. This is great right here. This is this is one of the better things we've done. Um, only handles, I haven't even put in fifth gear yet because it'll barely handle fourth. Uh, first gear is usually what I'm in. It doesn't want to steer the greatest, um, but yeah, it takes a lot of torque just to get it moving just because they're digging in so much, you know. It's perforating the dirt as we're going. Um, just insane, it feels so weird because they're, it's like infinite traction. You're never gonna spin out unless you start chilling, you know, the actual dirt up, so. Um, we're gonna go up, we're gonna repair this wheel real quick, and we'll be right back. Oh, that scared the <laughs> <one player. laughs> All the hair is gone. Oh my god. All the hair is gone. It, it liquefied. <laughs> oh, that scared you me. You alright? My hand's tense. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so sorry. He <laughs> legit it caught his hands on fire. These spikes are picking up everything. Like it's just punching right through stuff. I don't even know what this is. We made the spikes all seven inches uh, all the way around other than these outer ones. So at any time, we usually have about three spikes touching. So that's what makes the ride kind of smooth, actually. 